Okay, now swap level. Let's talk about swap level. Swap level basically dictates if pins are interchangeable. So if you think about a resistor, a resistor can go in either way, right? There, there, there's no preference of one pin over the other. So in that situation, you would set both pins on a resistor to a swap level of one. And that would mean that they're interchangeable, okay? They, they can be swapped. A swap level of zero means no swapping allowed. And then any levels greater than zero, all the pins that have the same number are interchangeable. So it allows you to define as many different uh, swap levels, let's say, as, as needed. So for this part, these are all unique, right? There's nothing that can be interchanged here. So we leave those alone. So the default always is zero. It's always mm -hmm. going to be the default. That way they're not swappable. And if, and if they have the same number, the same swap level number, and then they're only swappable among that number. So if the pins have swap level one, and then those are swappable. But if they have, one has swap level one, and the other one has swap level two, that's not, those are not swappable among each other. I hope mm -hmm. I, did I do that? Did yeah. I did that? Okay, I just want to make sure you understand that, okay? It, yeah. And that's not a priority thing. It's just swappable. You yeah. Know? Who's swappable with what? Correct. So that all that means, okay? Yeah, so... So if there's any questions, feel free to put it in. Mm -hmm. um, the gist of it is all the pins with the same swap level are interchangeable. So if they have the same number other than zero, they're interchangeable.